Scientism, the notion, the idea that science or empiricism is the only way to truth is an interesting one. And it's held by many atheists. And the argument that's made from this notion or this idea is that, well, what direct physical evidence do you have for the existence of God? And that point aside, what I want to really do is challenge this idea. Is this true? Is science the only way to truth? Because if it isn't, then the arguments that are based upon it break down. Now, when we look into it, what we will see is that, no, it isn't. And I want to point out a few reasons why. Number one, science itself is based on certain axioms, certain unproven assumptions which it cannot scientifically, empirically validate, such as the real world exists. And it's not just a figment of our imagination. Now, you cannot scientifically validate this, yet you accept it and you have to accept it to do science. Numbers, mathematics, these are all things you cannot scientifically validate, yet you accept. And this leads me on to my second point. There are many things we believe in which we have no empirical scientific data for, evidence for. We come to the belief in these things based on other means, via other routes to knowledge. For example, that your mother is your mother. Many of you hold this belief right now, yet you may not have any empirical scientific data for it. It's based on testimony, the testimony of your mother and your father. They told you that you're their son. Now you may say, well, I've got photographs, I have video evidence and so on. But once again, the fact that you believe that you are the one that's in those videos or in those photographs is based on the testimony of the one who took those photographs. Now you may also say, well, I can go and get a DNA test. I can go and prove that my mother is my mother scientifically. Well, we're not talking about potentials. That's something you could do. We're talking about this very moment. We're talking about the reality. We're pointing out, pointing out that you hold a belief which is not based on science. And this shows that we come to truth via other means too. And science is not the only way to truth. And finally, the last point I want to make is the statement. I'll point out the statement that science is the only way to truth is a self-refuting statement. Because if this was the case, then go ahead and prove the statement scientifically or empirically. You can't do that. You cannot quantify this statement empirically. It's self-refuting. Because if this was the case, then you would never know. Hence, brothers, sisters and friends, what I would humbly argue is that scientism or the notion that science is the only way to truth is flawed, it's limited, and it's something we need to transcend and go beyond now and realize that there are other means to truth and knowledge.